morning and it is time to get those bushes trimmed for the season and so that way we can get another round of blossoms. Today I've got an Anthony Water Spirea and I have a Wine and Rose Vigalia. Um, these ones are both done blooming for right now so we're going to give them a good trim so that way they can get their next round. Uh, the Anthony Water Spirea, in case you're not familiar, will get about four to five feet in height and likes full sun, can handle some part shade. The Wine and Rose Vigalia will be four to five feet as well. And the new growth always has this burgundy color, so kind of two-tone color this week. So with this one right here, um, with the Spireas, we basically want a round. Now we're doing this a little bit different than you would at your house. Usually um, ones that have been planted for many years, you can go down at least to 15 inches. Sounds like a lot, it's not though. That's really good for them. It helps them to thicken back up. These guys here, because they are for sale, we are basically going to round them up. So we're gonna give a nice haircut. Don't worry, we'll make it look good. And we're kind of basically looking for that new growth. So you can see right here, we've got a good, it's got a good round shape to it. And we're just gonna even it all off. And I always tell people to start on the top and work your way around. That way you have a good shape. You never wanna to go too deep because if you go too deep, it's going to take many years for it to rejuvenate back but this is perfect for the plants they will actually enjoy it very much as they'll get more blossoms for you on this wine and rose same thing you can tell that we've got the tall spikes here but right here in this area it's nice and flat so that's going to kind of be my my happy medium point so i'm just going to go right ahead and cut these and again, you're just basically rounding everything off. And when you trim bushes, you don't have to actually cut in a certain area like you do with the perennials or anything like that. And this will actually help get another round of blossoms. So now he's got a good shape to him. Again, with these guys, if they've been in the ground for quite a while, you can go 12 to 15 inches and that's perfectly fine. We do suggest using um, Sustain, which is a great organic fertilizer. We love using it. Put a handful right around the base, walk away. Every time it rains or you water, it'll slowly go into the ground. So that's what I got for you guys for trimming today. Let's see all of those bushes that we have been trimming. Send us pictures, we love to see it. Bye guys.